Welcome back guys, hope you're all well. Um, you're going to join us this week. Um, we're on a, a week's camping trip in Scotland. So it's going to probably be split into two parts this video. First part is going to be here at the Glen Nevis campsite, which is at the foot of Ben Nevis. Which for those of you who don't know, if you don't live in the UK, it's the tallest mountain in the UK. Um, we, this is our second time here. We came here last year and three out of the four of us managed to summit. Um, so we're here on some unfinished business, but it's a stunning campsite anyway. We would have come regardless. Um, so yeah, that, that's going to happen this week. There's a few more hikes dotted about if we have the energy, because it's very taxing to get up that mountain and back in a day. And then the second part is going to involve us. We're going to pack up all our gear, stick it back in the van, and head about an hour, maybe less than an hour, maybe half an hour, backwards um, to the Glencore mountain range which is another stunning mountain range that you pass through as you come here to Fort William to a campsite we've never been to before so we can't really tell you anything about it but I'm sure it's going to be as stunning as, as it is here so yeah that's going to be our week's camping trip stick with us stay tuned and we'll uh, we'll take you on our journey we're just going to get some food on the go now so I'll show you a couple of things we do we've just got a ridge monkey people you may have heard of one um, they're not all the made out to be when I was reading re reviews about them oh you can do this and do that and I don't really think you can but anyway you can do pizza or you can do the bottom half and then the other half you do under the grill um, we're, we're having stir fry which were pre-cooked um, and Riley he's having pizza because he won't have that so we'll get that on the go now Tomato sauce. I would have could be bothered. What's that? Pizza! Yeah, like I say, it seems a good idea. Supposedly this all heats up, but it just doesn't heat up quick enough to melt the cheese or anything on top before it burns the bottom. What about, would it be better on the barbecue that? Because it's I don't, more heated, isn't it? Yeah, well, what they say, you've got to turn it around, but you can't turn a pizza no, around. You can't turn a pizza around. Yeah. Yeah. Just going under the grill. <laughs> so we just pre cut some stir fry rice at home, bagged it up. And now it is going to get heated up and then eat it up. I'm probably best off. Um... I'm sure of it. You want to get some stones? Well, just let me get this tea and squeeze. Oh, that is not oh. Oh, that is not In the hot wind, there's a bit of a... I'm staring at me like, what happened to you? I'm there like... <laughs> 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 she's just running off. <laughs> Mum! Dad! Riley fell on! I know he's really... She's no, she didn't. Straight to ten. Where's Riley? Don't know. <laughs> I just came here for a drink. <laughs> just going to... Um, Quickly wash the pots that we just used, having some food. Get massively attacked by wasps. Normally in here it's the um, midges that are a problem, but they haven't shown themselves yet, but wasps are just everywhere. I have killed a few, and I'll kill more. Don't want you to worry about that. What is going on with your head? So why have you got? Why We're just you got prepping here? some um, food for swing? tomorrow for the hike up Ben Nevis. It's gone absolutely freezing now. The wind's picked up. I've had to take my um, tarpaulin shelter down. 
So we're just getting that sorted now. We'll probably leave the video here for tonight, for, for today. Um, pick yeah. it back up tomorrow. Maybe. Yeah, because Kelly might not have survived with all that alcohol she's consumed. I think warm myself up. Um, yeah, starting to go a bit dark, a bit cold. Cameras aren't going in the dark, they don't work very well. But yeah, uh, I probably won't show you all of the hike up tomorrow. Because like I said, I've got a video already on my channel of us going up doing that, so I'll link that, as I've said. But I will just give you a few moments, maybe at the top. Probably won't see anything because it's supposed to be really cloudy tomorrow and 7 degrees at the top, so we've not really brought the like correct clothing for that. But we'll survive somehow. So yeah, we'll put you back up in the morning, unless anything really exciting happens between now and then. Bye. Right, we're just at the start now. Riding up into the clouds up yonder. Riley thinks we're going up Everest by the looks of him. Riley. <laughs> So yeah, I'll stop at a few points and just let you have a look. It's a, a long way to go yet. Yeah. Uh, stopping for a quick break. We've done alright. We've walked for nearly two hours now and not stopped. Just last time we came up, I think we stopped every five minutes, it felt like, anyway. So we're going to have a quick rest and then we're going to have our way. Right on the top, it's, no, like, I have a, to, it's like a claw. You know what else I do? What? I have to put me, I have to tongue it because I have to confirm that the holes are. Because imagine if I don't, without looking at it, if I just go like that and it's sideways and it's all down in front of me, so I have to go like that. <laughs> put my tongue in. Honestly, no yeah. Way. Before I drink it, I just put my tongue in. Ah. <laughs> do not do that? Well, what if you just pick it up and it's like backwards? Oh. That brew weren't meant to happen, were it? Yeah, what if you pick it up Wait. without looking and it's backwards? Oh, what's that, a midge? <laughs> no, John, it's not you. Um, and um, that, is it not a midge, it's a mint. Oh, no. <laughs> it's definitely not what I am. <laughs> right, anyhow, we're back from uh, our hike up bed now, isn't now. We did pretty well, I think, in six hours and Six hours. Oh, six hours. It was completely clouded out when we got to the top, it was freezing. We set off in shorts and t-shirt, we ended up in uh, duffel jackets and everything at the top. I've got a little bit of footage 
Um, I'll show you that. I'll probably chuck it in now. And yeah, we're back. We had a shower, freshened up, chilled out. We're gonna go for something to eat up at the Ben Nevis restaurant. So we're actually gonna head back that way later on and uh, just see what happens for the rest of the evening. We've got a, another walk planned tomorrow. Um, it's a waterfall. Again, we have been before. I don't think there's, other than going hiking through the mountains, there's not millions of uh, hikes you can do. Well, yeah, there probably is to be fair, but we've not, we've not looked that far. Anyway, we're gonna do that tomorrow. We'll probably take you with us on that one. And, uh, and then Wednesday, like I said, we're packing up. I'm riding down and we'll probably show you that as part two. So we'll end it on that. <laughs> oh, was it? Oh. Yeah. oh, the green thing is there. I don't know, let's have a look at that. I'm not getting. Right, we're just going to get into the restaurant in a second. Ben Nevis restaurant, which is on the route up to Ben Nevis itself. So when you're coming up and you've already been up like we have, you think, oh my god, I've got to go up there again. <laughs> so yeah, let's see if I can show you inside. Ben Nevis burger, pasta, or fish bites. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pump the ISO up on this so it's much bigger. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we've just uh, finished now our meal at Ben Nevis Inn. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, I tried to show you a little bit, but obviously it was quite dark in there, so I couldn't really show you. But we're only back down to the camp now. Um, there's probably not much going on tonight Like I say, we're gonna head off for a, another walk tomorrow to a, a waterfalls, which will take you with us So if there's anything interesting that happens between now and then I'll, uh, I'll film it up for you. I'll film it for you. I'll film it for you. I'll film it for you anyway I'm just going to put together a breakfast burrito and I'll show you what I do because when I'm watching uh, YouTube videos I like to see what they're cooking so I can get ideas and inspiration. It's basically um, potato, onions, egg and bacon sort of mixed up together and put in a wrap. It's better than it sounds but I'll show you as we go along. So first of all, obviously chuck a bit of oil in your pan. What I do, I film this in, well, I film it, I cook this in parts, so I'll do the onions first, put them to one side, do the potatoes one side, do the bacon, put them to one side, and then the egg at the end, and add everything in, mix it all up, so I'll take you through that now. Oh. Onions, potatoes, grated potato, for ease of frying. Get our onions nice and brown, then put them to one side. And then, probably add a little bit more oil. A lot more oil, maybe. <laughs> then we're we'll going with our grated potato tall. I'm just going to get our eggs now. I did this yesterday and did five eggs in it, a bit too much. So we're just going to shave an egg off. Just wash your eggs up, get your pepper mixed in there. 
prevalent over here. Look at the potatoes here, the draining off getting nice and crispy. That's the sort of stage you want to get them to. And then flip them over to the other side. So when I get to about sort of that colour, put that to one side. And I'm gonna just switch pan for this because the bacon leaves a bit of a mess, but cut the bacon on here, um, the egg on here, and then we're gonna combine them all. So you just cut your bacon to your desired um, what's it called? What you want? Well, it's desired, isn't it? Yeah, desired. You so like you cut it. your bacon to how you like it. I like it a bit crispy, so we'll leave it on for a bit longer. Oh, last bit of bacon cooking, so I'm going to get the eggs on. What I, what I do with these, I keep them moving a bit, not too much, I don't want it like a soft scrambled egg, but I don't want it stuck in one piece. So I'm just going to put all this together now, I'm going to get the onions back in, the potato back in, and the bacon. Warm it all through and then into the wrap, cheese on top, and there's no sriracha or sweet chilli, so I'm gonna have ketchup. Kel's gonna have nothing, just as it is. <laughs> so I'll show you the finished article in a minute. So I'll just put everything back together, just cut the bacon up into little pieces, mix it all together, warm it all through. We're now ready to serve. Let's get our wrap. Are we just having one big wrap again? Yep. Get the cheese. Yours, Cal. There you go. On breakfast burrito. Cookbook's out soon. Subscribe for more recipes. Oh, yeah, so we're just uh, hauling our way up to the falls now. The rain's held off for the minute. Oh, look at that. What's going on there? But yeah, well, uh, we'll take you on a little trip with us. So there's the falls behind us, we've just shown you. Um, a bit of a <laughs> disaster coming over here on the wire bridges that you saw me and Riley. Uh, me and Riley crossed, Riley went back, Caitlin came with me, and then Cal and Riley decided they are going to come now. And they got, <laughs> Cali got three quarters away and crossed, and for some reason decided that putting the feet sideways is not good, that it should just put a feet forward. And the next step, both feet came off and she's hanging. With all my camera gear, all over the sack. 
Oh God, everybody was like big gasp. <laughs> but she managed to pull it, yeah, pull it together and get back on and made it to the end. But what a trauma that would have been. But anyway, yeah, this is the falls in the back. Um, I'm just going to head back now, back to the van. And uh, we'll probably see you back at camp if nothing else happens. <laughs> so we're back from our walk on the for the Steel Falls, or Stell Falls, still don't know how you say it. Um, we're just off to another restaurant tonight. We don't go to restaurants every night, it's just that we decided that we knew we was going to be doing a lot of walking and thought, you know, coming back home to the tent and then cooking, it's a bit of a pain, so. We're going to another restaurant tonight and then obviously tomorrow we're packing up and heading back down to Glencoe to another campsite for three days where we'll be cooking all our food. Got to pick some stuff up from a little on the way. Um, so yeah, if we can film anything in here I will do. If not, we'll uh, see you on the other side. So back at the camp now, just got back from our meal, which is decent, I think I've shown you a few images there. Um, just going to chill out now back in the tent, the wind's picked up quite a lot. We may have a fire after, there's a couple at the side was invited us to, uh, to the fire pit next door, so we might just sit around and do the same again tonight. Um, and yeah, we'll probably pick you back up in the morning if nothing happens in between. Right guys, um, we're going to end the video there on this section of the trip. We're now heading down to our next campsite in Glencore, which is about half an hour's drive away. So we'll pick you back up there. Thanks for watching. Like the video if you like the video. Subscribe. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.